hi everyone and welcome to my channel so today i have for you a dollar tree haul i went to the dollar tree in freeport texas and i found a few items to share with each of you so starting off i found this super cute soap dispenser lather rinse a repeat i thought this would be really cute in the restroom so i picked it up next i picked up a new snack that i had not seen before and it is tahine chili and lime peach rings so that is interesting you get two and a half servings per container and each serving is four pieces so they're pretty good i tried them they're they're kind of thick the the ring is kind of thick and kind of um hard harder maybe a little tough that makes sense and it's sprinkled with the tahine so this was a good snack i liked it so i picked up that i picked up two and i ate some of the other one next i picked up these really cute socks these are two cute um they had a lot of different ones they're really soft and uh, that is really really soft but these are really cute just to chill out you know in the winter time I don't like wearing socks during the summer. It's so hot and my feet get hot. But I thought these would be really cute for a winter time. So I picked up those. Next, I picked up my daughter and granddaughter some of these bobby pins. Um, they're by Remington. Um, you get 45 of them plus three extra bandies. So I picked that up and these are like a matte instead of that shiny, they're matte. So that was a good buy. Next, I picked up some ponds. I had not seen this one before. This one is a perfect color complex, normal to dry skin, anti marks for natural color. It's beauty cream, I don't understand. So, Oh, it fades away dark, clinically proven to fade away dark marks for natural color. So, picked that up. Next, I picked up the granddaughter, one of these uh, scrunchies by Scoonsy. It's kind of the iridescent Aurora Borealis effect, kind of like a mermaid type. So I thought she would probably like that one. I picked that up for her. I picked up these um, 32 count Bolero rose water. Um, I am me and my daughter are all about the rose um, scent, and uh, so I'm, I wanted to try these. If they smell like rose, it's so thin I can't smell it so anyway but they're for sensitive skin um i i like the bolero wipes they they take off my mascara really nicely so i picked those up next i picked up another bolero product this is chamomile rose bath bombs you get three in there three for a dollar i thought that was a good buy um turn your bath into a calming experience so that's pretty cool next i picked up this freeman beauty infusion purifying in shower mask this is a really good buy instantly boosts clarity restores balance and renews skin it's got sea kelp plus probiotics dermatologist tested so i've seen other people um haul i think like two other ones besides this one but this is the only one that i found in my local stores next i picked up some gone bananas laffy taffy i love the banana ones and could do without the rest so um i picked this up you get three and a half servings for three bars each serving so um there's a joke on here. It says, knock, knock, who's there? Orange, orange who? Aren't you glad we've gone bananas? 
So, anyway, those uh, orange ones are my, I mean, not orange, the banana ones are my favorite. Next, I picked up this uh, Doctor Who Mad Lib. And actually, I think I got this in Angleton. The Villains and Monsters. So, me and my granddaughter will do this. Uh, we have one right now that we've been working through, and it is um, Finding Nemo. So, this is a really good way for the kids to practice their nouns and verbs and adjectives and plural nouns and all the things. So, that's a, it's fun, and it also is teaching, but also reinforcing what they have already learned. So, we like that. Next, I picked up this magnet. Teamwork makes the dream work. And uh, I have uh, quite a many magnets um, on my, um, at my desk, like up on my upper cabinet. And so I picked that up. It's kind of a, like a canvas, if you can see that. So I picked that one up. Next, I picked up this a really cute little pink um, macaroon, macaron. I don't know what the difference is, but I liked it. I'm, I've always wanted one of these, but I've never like picked one up. And so I did. And now I can't open it. So that's great. Oh, geez. Why does this happen? Okay, well, I can't open it. That's stupid. I opened it up in the store. Huh, anyway, okay, I don't want to mess it up. So, I picked that up. I thought that was pretty, and uh, I wanted it. So, I picked it up. Next, I picked up some of these um, eyelashes. Everyone else has been picking up all the Ioni... Uh, if that's how you say it, eyelashes, and I've never found them. So I have no idea how to put these on. Um, so I will be gifting these to my daughter and let her have some fun. She loves all things makeup and beauty and shopping and style and all the things. So we'll do that. This is Extra XL Whimsy Wispy dramatic this one is natural light doll this one is wispy full dramatic and a last but not least is natural light wispy so she will really enjoy those i know she will so next i picked up one of these really nice sunflower um clips they had three different colors but this is the one that i chose for now it has the sequence in the middle it is a really pretty large um sunflower and i just thought that was pretty um, i will be picking up some more but for now i wanted to pick that up next i picked up this a really nice book i actually got this book at the lake jackson store this is called romantic prairie style and this is a really nice book it retailed for 29.95 usa and i will give y'all a flip through just to show y'all it's got really pretty photography and just a really, really nice book. So I was excited to get that. They also had another one that was Scandinavian style and I didn't get it. And then when I left, I'm like, I should have got it. Cause we really like, like the boho, um, style, the, um, yeah, the boho style and scandinavian is really close to the boho style so hopefully when i get back to the late jackson store they will still have it so got that next uh freeport has boxes of shirts when i was there they had two boxes still so i picked up a couple um 
I usually try to pick up twos, one for me, one for my daughter. They had these um, comfort wash um, sleeveless shirts is what I'm trying to get out of my mouth. Um, I like to use these really just to mow grass, but um, you know, you can, we have one of the power presses, the professional, um, you know, where you put the letters on there. We have one and we haven't really used it too much. So we could either, you know, reverse tie dye these. We could put sayings on our shirts. We have a Cricut and we have the power press so we could do that. And then I picked up this shirt as well for the winter time. This one is also a comfort color. I did get it in an extra large so I could wear it with tights and it would hang low enough to cover my bum. But this one is a long sleeve and I was glad to pick that up. So that is, we got one more item, sorry. Next, I picked up this really cute white vase. And so, y'all know me, if I find something, I wanna stick a plan in it. So I went outside and I cut one of my little arrowhead um, runners off of my plant. And I just think that will be really nice. Um, you need the roots. Remember, you got to have roots. And I'm just going to cut that leaf off so it doesn't die in the water. Stick, stick them in there. Let me pull the, the, the tag off of it. And I got me some bottle of water. And this is going to be so cute just hanging out. Pour some water in there. I don't want to overspill and get on my book. <laughs> okay, so literally, I just plopped him down in there and he is going to grow big and strong and then I will put him somewhere else and I will get another baby. So that is going to be really cute. And I can't wait to get that in. It's a new home to grow big and strong. Anyway, guys, I hope you're having an amazing Monday. Um, Mondays are my day to kind of relax um, and kick back and watch whatever I want to watch, whether it's other YouTubers or something on TV or whatever. But Mondays, I try not to get a lot of things um, on my schedule to do because uh, usually on Sunday I get all my rushing around done and cleaning and all that so by the time I get to Monday and um, you know Mondays kind of can be hectic at work so I just like to to sit down and just chill on Monday evenings so anyway guys y'all take care if you've enjoyed my video please give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button become part of my friends here on youtube and i'll see y'all in my next video bye